Okay, hi, I'm making this video. I just rolled my windows up so that people around me can't hear me. Um, but I want to, this is my Portland leather um, bag. I saw online that you can flip them inside out and then flip them right side back out and it changes the color and it makes the like wearing go faster. And mine is like literally very, very stiff. Um, so I was hoping that it would soften it up a little bit because at this point I'm like scared to do things with it because I'm afraid that it's gonna ruin it because it's so stiff and like I want to I want it to feel more loved um and this is totally just a personal preference um just my personal issues but I was looking for a video online on how to flip it and I could not for the life of me find one um So I'm going to show you my uneducated way of trying to flip it. Um, I read online in one of the Portland leather pages that you should like, there's like the hem, crease, I don't know. Don't know why I can't think of the word for that. Um, and that you should pull by that and like kind of roll it into itself. I'm just scared. I'm afraid that I'm not gonna like the color because I love the color of it now. It just, I want it to be more, I want there to be more depth. It's very solid and like in some pictures it almost looks like it's black and like clearly that is not the color. Um, this is cognac. So, yeah, um, I'm just gonna get into it. Shut up. Okay, I tried to get a couple before pictures. So, as you can see, it's like slightly reddish. Um, I also saw some suggestions online that you should wear gloves or have short nails because you will scratch it. And, you know... I want it to feel more loved and used, and I want to be more comfortable and not afraid. Oh, as I scratch the crap out of it with my nail. I just don't want to be afraid of it. Um, I have this big, huge gouge in it in the front for my keys. Oh, my hands are a little sweaty. Um, yeah, I'm just going to do it. So, I'm going to try to pull while simultaneously pushing on this side, I guess. And kind of roll it in. I got scared. <sighs> yeah, it's gonna come up that more cherry color. I just gotta do it. I wanna do it. I'm trying to make it so you can see more of what I'm doing, but I don't know if it's possible. It was funny one of the comments on somebody asking how to do this was like you're gonna want to be gentle but just don't you're literally flipping it inside out it's the point of it is to make it look more worn you don't have to be so nice to it like it's accurate i want to be super nice to it am i gonna get it past halfway i'm not sure I'm stuck here. I literally have a white jacket on. Well, I took my jacket off, but... And white pants on. So I'm, like, worried that I'm going to stain my pants, too, from the leather. But I've had this bag for over a year. I think I've had it for two years now, actually. And again, I'm just scared to use it. I'm scared to abuse it, and I want... to feel like it's well-loved. And... I 
I'm scared of the fact that I'm gonna have to do this again to flip it right side in. Ow. But I got halfway. This little thing came up on it and I literally thought I just scraped the leather and I was, I was torn for the smallest moment. I was like, well, that's it. I just ruined my bag. I'm talking in this as if I'm not just going to speed right through it when I edit it. Ooh! Finally! Okay, so this... Side note that this is a gorgeous color. Also, my corners had gotten super dirty and I was sitting here sitting here looking at the inside of the leather going, I don't think it's supposed to look like that. Okay. Maybe the second time it'll be easier, right? Again, I thought my nail, I felt my nail get stuck on it a little bit and I thought that I just like scratched the crap out of it. I'm mostly okay with it looking a little bit more loved, obviously, but I don't want another scrape in it like I have in the front that's taken literally a year to look back to somewhat normal. Because when I first did it, it was seriously so deep. Okay, so I had already had a little bit of scratching right there. You can already tell it's like a completely different color. Oh, it feels so nice. <gasps> ah, I'm so excited. I'm so glad I did this. I'm over here sitting in the car, just feeling anxious. Oh, okay. I'm gonna do a little bit more messing with it. I could not do this before. Like, it was so stiff. I couldn't do anything like this. Do some more squishing. Because right here I see that it needs a little bit more color. <gasps> I wish you could, I wish I could explain how much better this feels. It doesn't actually look that much different, I don't think. This is a pretty hefty dye though, um, but on camera it does look more red. Okay, I'm gonna take some after pictures. Well, thanks for hanging out with me. I'm so super glad I did that. Um, I'm gonna put my strap back on the way that it was because I really liked it. Um, be smarter than the bag. Thanks for hanging out with me. I am so glad I did that. Um, it didn't even, it brought the reds out a little bit, but I don't really feel like it changed the look of it that much, but it feels so much more different. I'm not, I'm not so scared. I'm excited. I didn't ruin my pants. My hands aren't really that dirty. My nails are actually pretty long right now. Um, and that I didn't scratch it up. So thanks for hanging out with me. <laughs> Bye guys.